Hey guys, it's me here. So today we're in a, a in a bit of a different area. Today we're in the kitchen. So yeah, uh, and today uh, uh, this is my 100th YouTube video. That might change if I delete past videos, but hopefully I won't. All right. So basically, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna teach you. That's right, you how to make some no GF juice. All right. So first of all, you're gonna need a glass. I don't have a glass. Let me wash a glass. Ah, it's warm. I shouldn't have used as much salt. Hey, do you guys ever watch Chef? Alright, so we got the glass. Alright, so second of all, we gotta get some um we, we gotta get some boiling water. Alright. Alright. He gets loud from here on out, so I'm just gonna stay silent. Now, third of all, you're gonna need some, uh, some no GF juice powder. Now, I got some right here. Uh, you can get some at your local no GF juice dealer. They also sell no GF juice syrup, uh, for like, uh, slushies. Just, like, don't ever have uncut no GF juice. I just, let's just say, uh, I, I used to know a guy, and uh, he, he isn't much of a guy anymore thanks to one cut no GF juice. So next you're gonna need to um, unscrew the lid, right? Then add just some, add some, you know? That, that may be a little bit too much if you ask me. I'm just like... So yeah, uh, this is this is uh, what an OGF juice powder usually looks like. I'm actually I'm actually having uh, one of its newest flavors today, um, uh, grape, because uh, you know grapes pretty good. Now what you're gonna want to do is add some boiling water. Mm. Now you may be wondering, Jamie, why would you add boiling water to an OGF juice? Don't you want it cold? Wait, see, this is actually where you choose uh, <laughs> how you want your no GF juice, warm or cold. You, you, you see, it depends on the t t type of day you're having. If it's like a warm day, have some cold no GF juice. If it's winter, also have cold no GF juice. Trust me, I cannot stress how bad warm no GF juice is. Next, you're going to get a spoon. This is a spoon, it's just very long and sharp, alright, and thin. Now you're going to want to mix the powder in there. Also, I'm using hot water and or boiling, boiled water to, uh, you know, to, uh, mix, to, so the, the, the powder can dissolve. I usually like to use carbonated lemonade for this, but, you know, I don't have that. Because my mom is middle class. <laughs> now, this is pretty good. Hold on a second. Now, I see, this is where you add regular water. Let me add some regular water. Now, I added some cold water so that I can. not be as warm, you know, but, mm. this isn't even the final step, this isn't even my final form, alright, you, you haven't seen my hair go blonde yet, more importantly, uh, what you're gonna wanna do, is put this in the freezer or refrigerator, I just like a, alright, cool, we are, we are, here, so it's our focus layer. It's like a moist care. So now what you're gonna wanna do is that you're gonna wanna, you know, it's hard to um, it's it's hard to uh, open a refrigerator and freezer with your uh, with your p p p inky toe, but, but you know I, I I do that every day. So we what we're gonna do is uh put it in the freezer. 
You could put it in the refrigerator all the time. What? The knife's still in there. Save that for later. What are you going to want to do? Put it in the freezer. Alternatively, you can put it in the refrigerator if you are a wimp. So yeah, now we just got to wait for the no GF juice to cool down. Because boy, oh boy, I don't want warm no GF juice. Not again. You can't make me. I'm not going back to jail. Alright guys, it's been a few solid, uh, good solid couple minutes. So, uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the no GF juice out of the freezer. So let's do this. <laughs>